Productions. Hey, what's going on, YouTube? This your boy D Gray, one half of Beast Mode Productions. Shout out to my partner, Mr. Q Notes. I'm doing this quick video because, you know, I got my hands on something that I wanted to pass out or to help pass out to everyone. And I did not come up with this creation, but it was put out there. So, for those that's been wanting to enable or re-enable the legacy pattern blocks in FL Studio 11, here you go. I have a register key that I unlock it. So as you can see, I'm in FL Studio 11. Just to show you guys. FL Studio 11, producer edition. All right. So, as you can see at the bottom, there they are. Now the thing with this register key, when you go to options, and what is it, general, enable, you cannot turn them on and off. So once you install this registry key, the legacy blocks will just stay on there. You can't enable or disable it. The only way to be able to get rid of it is if you delete it from your registry. So, just wanted to put that out there. So, all you need to do, I'll put the link to, um, I have it on my A drive. So I'll put the link to my A drive to download the registry. And it's gonna look like, it's gonna look like this. And all you go to do is just double click on it and just go ask, um, do you want to install or make changes or something, something of that nature? It will say yes and it's going to tell you that it's been successful. So then you're going to close out of FL Studio if you already have it open and reopen it and your legacy pattern blocks will be enabled. And that's pretty much it. And shout out to everyone that's been coming to the videos and supporting us. And please come by to look forward to more videos and more tutorials that we'll be doing in the future. Thank you. Beast Mode Productions.